this video you'll learn what it means when you see or drive a car in your dream. Hi, I'm Karen and I dream a lot and I like to study and talk about dreams and dream interpretations and do dream interpretations for people. If you've ever had a car dream that you remember, leave it in the comments below. Cars and dreams are pretty common and they're all about how you navigate life. Generally, they are talking about your drive, right? The pun, dreams like puns, so your drive, your motivation, how your, your ambition, or how you're navigating through a situation or through your life. Again, dreams are referring to something that happened two or three days before the dream, and they're talking about your, your concerns, things that you're uh, focusing on, or things that maybe you would be a good idea for you to focus on that your subconscious wants you to know and focus on that maybe you weren't really quite aware of. So when you're dreaming about cars, you're dreaming about your motivation, you're dreaming about your drive, your ambition, and how you're getting there. So if you are the driver in the car and when you're driving, you are taking an active role. If you are the passenger in the dream, then you are taking a more passive role in your life right now. And that's up to you to decide. Maybe it's okay that you're taking a passive role, or maybe you want to be the driver. You want to be in control of where you're going in your life. If you're in the back seat of a car in the dream, then that means that you're letting others take control. You might be putting yourself down. Now, sometimes we want to let others take control in our real lives, but many times in our lives, we don't want to have others take control. We want to be in charge of our own life. And so dreaming that you're in the back seat is often a sign for your subconscious saying, hey, you're not quite uh, navigating your own life. And that's for you to decide if you want to change that or not. Do you want to get in the front seat? Do you want to be the driver? If you're driving in your car and it's a very smooth ride and you're going places, that means that things are going smoothly, you're getting there, you're going there. I've had a number of dreams where I'm driving on highways and actually there seems to be the same kind of set of highways that I tend to drive on. Now, does this mean, or is this a reflection of the fact that I've driven on a lot of highways in my life? Because I have, I've been in a lot of big cities and done a lot of highway driving, <laughs> a lot of highway driving. Is that all it's reflecting? And possibly, but I tend to believe that what it is is saying it, this where you're at at this stage in your life or what you're facing in these these few days before the dream are that same kind of sense of driving on a highway right you're driving you're getting there you're going there you have drive you have motivation and you're on your way all is going well sometimes dreams are telling us everything's fine everything's going well they're not all telling us bad things not all dreams are telling us this is what you need to work on or this is what you're worried about sometimes dreams are saying hey all is well. If you're getting value from this video, please click the like button below. That way more people will find it and they can find out what it means when they dream about a car. Thank you. What if you're driving and the things are, and it's rough? It's a rough road. You're going up and down hills and mountains or you're on a cobblestone street or lots of boulders or you're having to drive around them or there's eggshells on the road. I've had someone ask me to interpret a dream once where there were eggshells on the road, right? What does that mean? So when the drive is not as smooth, that's talking about the obstacles that you have in your life. It's talking about that there are things getting in the way. And sometimes we know that we have obstacles going on in our life, but sometimes we're not quite aware that there are obstacles. And so look at what else is happening in the dream, maybe what you do about those obstacles. If you get up to the obstacles and you stop, then the dream is talking about, oh, you've, you've decided not to go any further, you're letting the obstacles stop you. If you are going over the bumpy road, but you're still going, then that means, hey, you're facing obstacles, but you're still going. And this is where you want to also look at how are you feeling in the dream? If you're feeling really good, even while you're facing the obstacles, that's a sign that you're confident and you're gonna make it through. If you're scared and you get really freaked out by the obstacles in the dream, that's a chance for you when you wake up to look at your feelings around obstacles. Do I think obstacles are gonna slow me down? Uh, do I have to let these obstacles slow me down? So that's something that the dream is pointing out for you to think about when you're awake. If you're dreaming uh, that you're driving really fast, it can be either a message from your subconscious or a worry that you need to slow down, <laughs> that you're going too fast. Again, you decide, are you really pushing too hard and driving too fast towards your goals? You maybe are just going fast or it could be a warning to slow down. So look at what the dream is saying and then check inside yourself. Should I be slowing down right now? Is that a good idea for me to do? Am I leaving people behind? Is this a worry you have, or is it really what you're doing? That's what you need to take that kind of uh, sign or symbol and think about when you're awake, or talk to other people, or journal about it. If you dream that you can't see where you're going when you drive, and I hate this dream, <laughs> I have had it more than I like to admit, 
and it is a very scary dream because you just keep driving uh, in the dream anyway you just keep driving that actually means you don't know where you're going you can't see where you're headed you don't know where you're going and it could even be so far as to mean that you don't know where you want to go in life and that makes sense to me that like yeah there have been times where I didn't know where I wanted to go so it made sense that I had that dream where I couldn't see where I was going also just a reminder while I use the word in life a lot of times around driving especially and it is about your goals and your motivation it doesn't mean your whole life it can just be about a project or about a relationship or about something that you are focusing on right now so maybe I'm doing a project at work and I'm gonna have to um, put some stuff together and do a presentation or something like that and the dream is talking to me about that specific thing and that I don't know where I'm going in this particular project which often happens when we have a project we don't quite know where we're going I don't know about <laughs> you but for me that happens in my day job so that's again it's not necessarily saying oh I don't know what I'm doing with my life here I am you know <laughs> midway through and I don't know where I'm going maybe that's what it is about or maybe it's just saying, oh, in this one area of my life, I'm not quite sure where I'm going. If you're driving at night in your dream, that's also a little bit about you're not sure where you're going, you are kind of unsure, but it also can mean if you're driving at night that you don't want to look at where you're going. You don't want to face something. Sometimes in dreams, when we dream about nighttime or darkness, that's talking about unknown things, mystery, or things we don't want to acknowledge. So if you dream that you're driving at night, a good thing to do when you wake up is to consider, is there something that I don't want to see here? Is there something I am trying to ignore about this project or about my life or about what the dream is about, about my motivation, about my um, goals that I'm trying to reach? If you're driving on a curvy road, it means that there might be something sidetracking you or that you're kind of going um, in a roundabout way to where you're headed. And that is how success and, and, and achieving goals works, really. It, it's never, <laughs> I shouldn't say never, it's rarely a straight line. We get to where we're going in roundabout ways, and sometimes we take a fork in the road, and we take twists and turns, right? And sometimes our dreams are telling us that. Again, it doesn't mean it's a bad thing. It's just telling us we're still going there, but we may be taking a detour for a bit. And it's up to you to decide, am I fine with taking a detour, and it's okay, or... Do I want to try to look at getting back on my main road? If you are in the car and you're driving in reverse, that represents that you are not going where you want to go. <laughs> you are experiencing setbacks. You are probably already experiencing these setbacks when you have the dream that you're driving in reverse. It's very rare that it's going to be telling you, oh, hey, setback ahead. That's not generally how dreams work. They're not telling you, oh, you're going to have a setback. But right, that's why you write down the dreams. You write down dreams, you see, oh, am I, in a, am I facing some setbacks right now? Because generally, if you are, you know about it. If you're not facing setbacks, then the next question is, am I afraid that I'm going to face setbacks? Am I worried about potential setbacks? Again, you probably know that, but you need to check in with yourself to see if you do. If those two answers are no, then be aware, okay, there may be a setback ahead, and I'll be okay. What are some backup plans that I have? For potential setbacks and then that's what you do you you kind of plan ahead in case there's certain setbacks then that's about all you can do there's actually a lot more things that happen in cars when we're in dreams I'm not going to cover them all here that'll be another video in the future where I'll get into more things that happen in cars like uh, driving off a cliff or driving into water we'll cover that in a future video another kind of dream that is about your goals and where you're going are flying dreams and flying dreams are actually very fun unless you're scared in the dream. But generally when people are in flying dreams, they're not scared. So if you'd like to find out what it means when you fly in a dream, go ahead and click the next video. And thank you for watching this one. Also, please be sure and subscribe so that you will see each time I upload a new video, which is on Wednesdays. And you can follow me over on Instagram at Karen Dreams.